Oh yeah, how we doing? <sighs> Friday night, got an airport run to go and do, but I need to shave before the weekend. So, Dardana Short and Bell, which is OSP. This was the OSP line that James brought out when he started using uh, scented oils instead of essential oils. So this is Chambray. It's a lovely scent and I don't think it was a great seller but it is a cracking scent. The brush, there's a Rock 400, something nice and simple that can get dunked in the water. The razor, single edge, above the tie, SE1 on a bulldog handle. So, three piece, non adjustable razor that takes the Artist Club blades. There's the said blade, which is a feather professional, I believe. I'm not sure how many shares it's had. That's how the blades fit, they go to the top cap and the base plate drops in and you can see there's indents, cutouts in the base plate. There we go. That just holds everything together as long as you don't, don't drop the base plate. It's a lot easier in real life. Than it is with the camera running. So there's the base plate on. Sink's okay, didn't crack it, it's always a bonus. This was the came with the bulldog handle when I bought it. There's some gunk on it, it didn't look very nice, so that's off. So, any plans for the weekend? Mine involves chauff chauffeuring my stepdaughter and her partner to a wedding tomorrow. Not chauffeuring, as in certain time, just taking them there, picking them up from the airport tonight. And uh, there's the blade. Razor fully assembled with the blade. I can go and get some heat in there. And then after that, I may pay a visit to a local distillery to pick up a a bottle or two. So I'll just get into the soap and we'll take things from there. I want to pick up a bottle anyway. I visited there about a month ago, pulled in, I was like to building site and everything was shut up. The shop, the distillery, the whole lot, no production going on. Pulled the phone out, googled it, came back online. Six million pound development at the distillery. Okay, that's why everything's closed. But uh, they're open Thursday through to Sunday or through to Monday in December for Christmas. So obviously they can sell some whiskey. Should be more than enough. Probably is way too much. So, even though the distillery is in Aberdeenshire, Rohan, well, Aberdeenshire, it's classed as a Highland whisky. Uh, and the distillery is called Glen Geary, which is spelled Gary Ock. G A R I O C H. Which actually pronounced Geary. We did a distillery tour there a few years ago when all the family were up for Christmas because it was quite close to where we were staying and the tour was spot on, it really was, they were very very good. It was one of the best tours I've done. And they even had a couple of casks that they cracked open and allowed you to sniff. One was, I think one was 35 years old and one was 50. And there. 
you're talking some serious money for those bottles of whiskey as and when they are, those casks are bottled up. So SP, made by James Riley, down in Surrey in London. Shop's presently closed because James has gone back to university. And uh, so he's shut up shop for a while while he's busy getting his head on the books and getting everything else, life sorted out. So the day. What's more important? Your life and your future or making shaving soap to appease a few people? If he's needed to shut up shop, then he's made the right decision, in my opinion. But hopefully he shall return. I've got no idea when this video is going to get put out. I need to edit it and get it uploaded. Tonight's going to be quite busy, it's going to be a shaving out of the door really. Especially if this lather and take much, takes much longer. I turned the fan off tonight and I've got my me, me backlight on. As you can plug is here and tell. That'll do. There. It's better taste than soaps. Above the tie, SC1 with a feather pro. As far as single edges goes, this one's pretty good. It's not quite as good as the Colonial Razors General V1 that I've got, in my opinion. It's there's not much between this and the Razor Rock Hawk. They are just slightly behind the, the general. But these single edge blades are thicker than DAs. So they don't flex as much. And generally they last 10-12 shaves. even the feathers and you can buy the feather pro the super pro which is slightly wider so you get more it's more aggressive more bullet exposure on the razor then you get the, the pro guards from feather which are slightly narrower and I've guard, are guarded so again Instead of the razor being aggressive, you just change the blades out for different levels of graphic to have different base plates. Pick a different blade. The Kai SEs may well be the same. I'm not sure. Mainly use feathers and pro lines. Fairly sure this is a feather. It might be a pro line. This soap is a lovely scent, it's stereotypical OSP performance. The scent isn't in your face, 
It's a UK soap, so it can't be. However, it's very well blended. Maybe not as complex as some that are available, scent wise. James did tell me what this was based on a long time ago, but I forget. I don't think it's a, it was I don't think it was a big seller. I think it was sold. Possibly a dozen or so of soaps of this scent when he had them available. There's not a lot left. Despite this razor having holes on the base plate, it doesn't clog, it works. It works it works fine. I think above the tile we're probably one of the first new or modern manufacturers to use holes on the base plates. It's since been copied by a few others. But it works well. Lovely. Face wash and rinse with warm and cold water. That's sort of doing out. That feels really good. I'm not even going to bother with this tonight. I'm going to go straight to. <coughs> pardon me. Baxter of California aftershave balm. This was on special offer on Amazon a long time before Black Friday. It, at one point it was something like £2.50 a tube. Glycerin, aloe vera and menthol. Hasn't really got a scent. Uh, it's like a thick gel, clear. A thick clear gel. There we go there, hopefully you can see that on the hand. Yeah, thick clear gel.
which certainly wouldn't interfere with any sense that you choose to wear later on. And the back of the stuff's quite good. Excess jar for hands. So there we go, folks. So, quick recap of tonight's shave. Soap, Dadan Short and Bell, uh, Chambray, made by James Riley of OSP, but under a different branding as such because it wasn't pure essential oils, just so you could tell the difference. That was lathered up with the Razor Rock 400, with the yellow handle and the black Plisson type knot. We used an above the tie SE1 single edge razor on an Icon Bulldog handle, and inside there, there was, I think it's a Feather Pro on its nth use or whatever and we just polished off there with some Baxter of California aftershave balm that's it I think their flight takes off a quarter past six I'm gonna go quarter past seven even maybe it's quarter past six I'm uh, gonna go and check Google and see what happens and uh, if you have any comments leave them below Thanks for watching, bye for now.